President Joe Biden today showing people he is still at work despite testing positive for COVID yesterday. He gave public remarks about gas prices at a virtual roundtable today. KCA United Washington correspondent Hannah Brandt has more on the president's condition. President Biden is really trying to project an image of business as usual. At Friday's virtual meeting, you could tell he wanted to stay on message and reassure people he's still working. I apologize in my voice. I'm feeling much better than I sound. We got a glimpse of the president on Friday as he met virtually with advisors to talk about gas prices. Aside from an occasional cough and cough drop, his team says he's doing well. He slept well last night. Uh, he ate his breakfast and lunch. I fully. He actually showed me his plate. An update from his doctor says his symptoms are improving after his first day on the antiviral drug Paxlovid. He had a fever Thursday night. He took Tylenol and his temperature went back to normal. And his doctor emphasized since the president is fully vaccinated and boosted, he should continue to get better. He is getting world class treatment, exactly what you would expect for the president of the United States. This moment is a reminder for many people. As we get these more and more contagious variants, are more of us gonna get infected? Yes, of course. Dr. Greg Poland with Mayo Clinic says he doesn't think people are taking enough precautions. We are playing with fire. We're pretending that the pandemic is over. And he warns when you catch COVID multiple times. Regardless of how mild they are, you are adding and adding and adding onto your risk. And Dr. Jha also brought up the fact that the White House COVID team is still asking Congress to approve funding for a COVID package so that the country can pay for things like vaccinations, testing, and treatment to fight off the new variants. In Washington, I'm Hannah Brandt.